Okay, here's my uh, uh, present Mac is uh, OS 10.95. And let's take a look at what our version 10 is doing on our TriStar here. Now I've got a bunch of other imported uh, airfoils there that just did not match. So I finally settled it on the uh, SD8000. And by hiding this picture, we're working on the SIG TriStar. And for the beta people that uh, are looking at that part, uh, for the beta part of this uh, video, uh, the SIG uh, TriStar is quite an excellent flying canard type of bird and the problem that we're running into is there is not a wood structured wing so I'm going to hide the picture and now I wanted to hide those guys and then hide that guy. Now we see that this line from our center over to here is 24 inches. And here was a scaling triangle. I'll hide that. We don't need that. So now I'm going to go and using a box, selecting all, or I'll go edit select all and I'm going to do an origin copy uh, uh, double copy I'm sorry to the origin to put everything on the center now watch you see the uh, the construction of my conic uh, spacing if I was to do some edit undos I have a conical spacing that uh, as we start that conic from the root and move it out to the tip to get less and less ribs and a, a greater span so we have less weight out at the wing tip, uh, that part didn't uh, uh, copy. So that's that particular issue. Now, I'm going to return to show all and you see I extended this line to go out to the tip originally I just had the line going to here so some other verifications added undo show all and now I am going to see how much of all of this gets erased okay hide and We'll hide that. Okay. Now, I've got air, uh, aerodynamic settings, so my isometric is going to be slightly different. Oh, and my rib did not travel either. So, showing all... Uh, Hide that picture and viewing from the front. I want that. Whoa, come on here, little buddy. And then we'll do a copy endpoint to origin zero zero. Come on there, little buddy. Get in there. There we go. And there, I got it that time. Okay. Now. Alrighty. And now. Looking at the top view, a 
looks like I'll need to construct a new line zero hundred eighty zero intersect intersect twenty four point oh seven And bumping that back to zero. Yeah, we're good. Okay. And now. Now, scaling on the isometric or a trimetric sometimes gets a little fussy. So, making sure now we're looking up here to make sure we get the right data. 24.0 in the Y is fine and the Z is fine. And making sure we grab an end point instead of a midpoint. And then scrolling out, and I want to intersect. Catch that intersect right there. And skidding a solid. Let's see if our groups will work for us here. Sweet. And now we want to change this to a display of transparency apply. And color will change the color to uh, cyan because the big deal right now is we're checking out uh, a printing format so let's see how it all comes about Oop. let me turn on that layer and show all. Now this particular drawing is of 52 by 38. A size? I'm not sure. Edit, undo, show all. And We'll hide that, and we'll hide that. And now I go to uh, File, Page Layout. And we want a single page, and we want to page set up. We turn on our uh, preview page setup and take a look at my title oh that's not the right one 8 11 okay ah there they are fuse 3 view 5636 high I believe that's going to fit and then notice all of the uh, boundaries that we have and we go there and tell that OK here. And we're going to fit selected and align center. And then we go to overlay. And that's looking really good. And showing a page break OK. And there I get my difference. So that looks good for a print. OK, now for our next setup you see I've got a few layers turned off here and the only thing really visible is the construction and some of the layer stuff 
So now let's go into File, Print. Remembering now that this is with a Maverick. And it took a little while to crunch all of that data that was going on there. So well, I'd say about a minute and a half. And now we go save as PDF. And I am going to call that TriStar uh, Tri Solid. And I'm going to put that on the desktop. And hit save. Okay. We're all done with that. So now I am going to file page layout. I'm going to turn off my page break in the drawing window. Head OK. And I'm going to pop that puppy down there. And now... The Adobe is reading that just fine and bring it up to 100%. Whoops. 100. Enter. And obviously we're looking at some chunks of oxygen there and I'm scroll wheeling going up and over and up and there's the uh, this particular foil is uh, the uh, tracing that I used the conical tracing of and now let's see I go and close that off whoops and um, file get info I don't know okay 668 K's we can also open that with preview if there's some other stuff going on there that uh, uh, depending on some settings within the Adobe settings, there's a bunch of stuff going on in there as far as in the preferences within the Acrobat Reader. Uh, there's all kinds of stuff here in in the parameters and the page display is what we're highlighting at uh, basic setting at 92 I've got custom turned on to 110 etc 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 stuff and uh, that may be causing some because I think now with uh, the uh, 3D PDFs going on, now we're going to have a whole new bundle of parameters to play with. So maybe some of that is going on. And then we've got headers, etc., etc. So when you do have your Acrobat, uh, 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 Adobe for um, sharing files that people can put in and, and do your adjustments and stuff like that. I hope that helps. Um, so going through this one more time uh, file page layout Showing our page break, page setup, 
turning on, see now I've got the uh, 11 by 18 office jet is what I'm running. Now let's uh, use one of my other modification guys and that guy is 24 by 48 and I say OK and tell that OK and we see how that is not quite fitting so then of course there's fit to area and all of that kind of thing going on but as long as you have in your page setup and you go into your manage custom sizes down here you should be able to get the stuff you need to have going to a two meter wing will go into that kind of a layout etc 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 hope that helps you out folks